Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to resolve if you're attempting to adjust your speakers or volume settings and it says that no output devices are found. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process, guys, on how to resolve the issue. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump straight into it. So we are going to go in the search field here, search for troubleshoot best match, come back with troubleshoot settings. Go ahead and open that up. On the right side, underneath Options, select Other Troubleshooters. And then underneath Most Frequent, select the Audio Troubleshooter and the Run button. Select Yes. I'm going to select no, I did not hear a beep. It's going to ask, would you like to update your driver to fix the problem? I'm going to select yes. It's going to attempt to reinstall the driver. And then see if that's able to resolve the problem. Something else we can try here as well if you open up the search menu and search for device manager. Best match, come back with device manager. Go ahead and open that up. Select the view tab and select where it says show hidden devices. Double click on the sound, video, and game controller section. And now if you have a device listed in here, double click on it. Driver and then select update driver. Browse my computer for drivers and select my pick from a list of available drivers on my computer. Select next, and then yes. And see if that's resolved the problem. If you're still having the problem, something else we can try here as well is check for disabled audio devices. So open up the search menu, search for control panel. Best match should come back with control panel. So go ahead and open that up. Sort your view by by large icons up at the top right. And then you want to go down and select sound. So go ahead and left click on that. It says this device is disabled. Go ahead and right click on it and go ahead and enable it. And now your speaker icon should work again. So pretty straightforward process, guys. Do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.